Ready. You ready to fight? All right, so we got two classically trained strikers here. Any chance this fight actually goes to the ground? This fight does not go to the ground. Oh! Oh, the ground and pound strikes continue to rain down. The opponent better move out of harm's way or the referee's going to stop this. He better start to move. And when his opponent starts to posture, he needs to put his feet on the hip, push him away to try to escape this very, very dangerous DC didn't take him long his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Good point. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Nice job by Dustin Poirier there. Sticks the target and then... Oh, he's hurt! And he's got him hurt here. Oh! Oh, he might be out. That one appeared to stun him. Well, he's up. But oh, is he hurt. Uh, yeah, looks a little wobbly on his feet. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Oh, he got him hurt bad. All right, rubber guard now, DC. Some submissions at his disposal if he so chooses. Yeah, he does have a couple submissions. They're very rare submissions. Go-go plata, omo plata. But if the guy has any understanding of submission, yeah, he's hurt really bad. He's got him hurt here. Now into his mouth. That one was going to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice job to get back up again. You don't want to hang out on the ground with this guy. So 44 total strikes have landed for Justin Gage. Nice punch land. Just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows, he used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Now we go inside the octagon, Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop in this contest at three minutes, one second of the very first round. Declaring the winner by 